Hey y'all, it's Sean from Sean Vibes. I want to do a quick reading today. We are going to look at your money. I feel like there might be a message for you today regarding money. So let's see what we have here. Well, look at that. The first card I picked is the Knight of Pentacles. What else can we share with this group about their money today? We have the Knight of Swords as well. So we have Knight of Pentacles and Knight of Swords. More information for this group regarding their money. And we have the moon. Interesting. Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, the moon. Money messages for this group. Thank you. And the seven of swords. Okay. Someone is going to approach you. Your message here is to protect your money. Let me just go ahead and put that out there. Protect your money, okay? Someone is going to approach you with an idea. It's going to sound like a great idea because this person is a very good talker, all right? They're a very good speaker. They're very charismatic. They're very high energy. And if you're not careful, they are going to uh, talk you right out of your money. They're going to present themselves to you you with a really good sounding idea there you know um it might be someone that you already know i'm getting the sense for most of you that it's actually going to be a new association a new um and i feel like association might even be a strong word which is why i'm shying away from saying even just a new connection but someone that you don't already know someone that you meet uh in maybe a social situation i'm feeling very much like it feels very much like you're just going along minding your business and someone just shows up out of the blue so it could be one of those situations where there's a knock on your door and the person approaches you with a great idea right or you're coming out of the trader joe's and you know that person that goes hey ma'am can i talk to you today i want to you know do you know about xyz um, that, that kind of thing. I feel like for the majority of you, it is not going to be somebody that you already know, though for some of you, it may be someone that you know and already have a relationship with, which is one of the reasons why your first instinct is going to be to trust them. Your first instinct is going to be um, to believe their claims about what can happen with this great idea um and then for some of you it's gonna be that you want to help this person out because you care for them you love them so you know those home show businesses like um avon um what is it called crystal house uh premier designs crystal house is you know clearly crystal and premier designs is costume jewelry um any of those kinds of businesses, like multi-level marketing businesses, it might be something like that. If it's someone you know and they approach you with something like that, you are going to want to help this person. You are going to want to save this person, but know that this is not the right move for you at this time. In fact, I am getting very strongly, this is not the right move for you at all. There is something dishonest about this situation. So in, this, in the uh, scenario that I first mentioned where it's someone that you don't know and you're just being approached out of the blue by someone with this great opportunity, uh, this person is outright lying to you, okay? I'm just gonna go ahead and put it out there. With us getting the moon card here, as well as seven of swords, this person is out, we're outright lying to you. For those of you that the opportunity is going to come from someone that you know and trust already or know and love already, even if you don't completely trust them, you know, because a lot of us have that person in our family who they always got something right they always have some idea <laughs> they always have some like get rich quick or get rich soon kind of thing or this is the big thing you know um so you may trust them or not already but you do love them you do care for them if you are in that group of people receiving this message today the dishonesty is still there but it's not coming from that loved one of yours okay hear me clearly the dishonesty in that scenario is there's something wrong with the business there's something wrong with the opportunity there's something wrong with the idea that is why you should stay away from it keep your money hold on to your money do not follow this person into whatever big idea they're having 